Hello guys, today we will be going over applying relational operations in a logical expression. So we have this problem over here. A company wants to spend exactly $5,000 on chairs and tables. A chair is $150 and a table is $300. Write an equation that represents this, where our x variable denotes chair and our y variable denotes table. Actually, let me do some color coding. x is chair, y is table. So, we can make an equation. So, it has to be, they want to spend exactly $5,000. So, this means that it's going to be equal to $5,000. $5, where a chair is $150 and a table is $300. So, this would mean that we have $150 times our number of chairs, which is denoted by this variable, x plus our cost of tables, 300, times our number of tables, which is denoted by the variable y. So this is an equation that represents this wood problem. Now let's go on to the next. A wholesaler has $75,000 to spend on certain models of TV sets and VCRs. If the TV sets cost $375 each and the VCRs cost $215 each, write an inequality that restricts the purchase of X TVs and Y VCRs. Okay, so we have $75,000 total to spend, so $75,000. Now it can be less than or equal to $75,000. The cost of our TV sets and VCRs can be less than or equal to, um, to $75,000. $500? Okay, so let's also do some color coding over here. So we have our we have our X TVs and TV sets are $375 each. So we get 375 times our number of TVs which is denoted by the variable X here plus our we have $215 for VCR sets and Y VCRs. So plus 215Y must be less than seventy-five thousand, less than or equal to seventy-five thousand dollars. So that is an inequality that restricts the purchase of XTVs and YVCRs. Now, one last example here: a restaurant must make more than twelve thousand dollars a month to remain running. The restaurant makes a ten-dollar profit on pizza, which is our X variable, and a fifteen-dollar profit on bread, which is our Y variable. Right, an inequality that represents this. So we have to make more than twelve thousand dollars a month. So it must be so our equation must be greater than it's just greater than because it cannot be equal to just greater than twelve thousand dollars. So and we have we'll do the same color coding over here. We have ten dollars profit on pizza, which is denoted by our x variable. So we have ten ten x plus. Wait, let me, I should write this all a bit closer, come to think of it. So then 12, greater than $12,000. Plus we make a $15 profit on bread, Y variable. So plus 15Y is greater than $12,000 because we have to make more than 12,000. And actually come to think about this, it is a pretty large profit to be making on pizza and bread, $10 and $15. So anyways, thank you for watching and I hope that you found this video helpful.